Thermites are very cool and interesting creatures. So mites are actually extremely diverse. When we say mites, many people think of the ticks that are parasites on large animals. But that's just a very small group of mites. There's all sorts of mites with very long legs, mites that look like strawberries, mites that are very well armoured. Actually, we have three main uh, groups of mites. So the, the first group, Oribatida, they help to uh, cycle nutrients. They eat leaves, they eat fungi, they eat bacteria. And, and in doing so, they recycle nutrients and help to improve the soil health. Uh, Mesostigmata are all predators or parasites. And even as predators or parasites, they actually do have a regulating role. For example, the nematodes, the worms in the soil, many mites feed on this, and without the mite, the balance in the, in the populations of worms mm, would be much different. Um, and the third group, uh, Prostigmata, they do both. Uh, they, have, they have members that um, eat dead leaves, members that are predators, and so on and so forth. You see that actually the mites make up such a huge proportion of the, the, the biomass and the biodiversity. Um, yet, many of them are undescribed. They're also cool in the sense that they are very helpful to the ecosystem. Uh, they play a very vital role in forest health in that they cycle nutrients. So they convert nutrients that are stuck in dead matter, like in dead leaves, dead wood, into soil organic matter that uh, forms an important part of healthy forest soils. Healthy soils have some obvious benefits in terms of, you know, in, if the system is healthy, you are going to have to spend much less on fertilizers. On another side of things, healthy soils do sequester much more carbon than soils which are highly eroded and, and just devoid of life. And lastly, I think the invertebrate community, they are a big part of biodiversity. Many vertebrates and other animals will feed on animals that are living in the soil and the litter layer. And this, this, this pool of organisms that lives in soil, they support the biodiversity that, that we love.